Good morning, everybody. Well, at least in my world this morning. Um, hopefully, I'm getting back to doing this stuff. We've had so much sickness going on. Sabrina's finally, 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 I think, feeling better. And then yesterday being my birthday, yada, yada. Uh, so what I want to do, guys, is I have a Barbie, <clears throat> excuse me, haul that I wanted to show you. Um, I hope you're joining us on Whatnot. Because these Barbies will be up for sale this coming Friday in a mystery Barbie thing that I'm doing. I'm sorry, you guys know me. I have my call here dressing them, doing stuff. But basically what I'm doing is, I haven't completed it yet, but that's what I'm doing today. I'm making, um, I guess you could call them, they're bags, but I guess you could call maybe a sleeping bag for Barbie or bedding for Barbie, how, whatever you want to call it. Each bag is guaranteed to have a Barbie. And in, in the Barbie is guaranteed to be clothed. Not necessarily in the clothes that she came that are for that particular Barbie. But she is dressed to be clothed and with an accessory. And the accessory can be anything from necklaces, handbags, shoes, possibly a pet, another little Barbie. I mean, you just... Barbies like this not sure so it's guaranteed to be a Barbie clothes with an accessory and I take it back that when I say an accessory I mean like clothes or one of those little Barbies or um, one of the little pets so that's what I mean by an accessory um, she will uh, the jewelry and stuff is all part of her um, look but just to give you an idea, I got this Barbie, and I dressed her. She, of course, she was naked, so I got this Barbie. Um, this is the the Millicent mold. They use this mold for almost for like every single Barbie out there ever. So this is the Millicent mold, and she, as you can see, she is dressed. She has a purse. She has her bands. She has her little um, necklace. And she has shoes. And she's in perfect condition. She's, I'm pretty sure she's a fashionista. She's a modern Barbie. But what will happen again is she will be in a mystery bag. You won't know what Barbie you get. They'll all be in these bags. The bags will be going for $10. And then the Barbie, and then you pick the bag you want. They'll be numbered. And there's, at the moment, and I don't think I'm going to get any more, but at the moment, there are six seven i wanted to get 10 i may run out to the store um later and see if i can get some more barbies but yeah so um that's what i'm doing this friday on whatnot so come check it out it's at 7 30 in the evening eastern standard time and so i'm going to be giving away barbies so we have this one and she's ready to go she i don't have anything more to do with her she's just going to go with the bag uh, i have this barbie now she is the doctor barbie she came with her at least I assume she's a Dr. Barbie. I've got to do some hairbrushing. Because she has her little scope. But she's got her little mask. She's got this little outfit on here. It was a little big on her. So I put the belt to kind of cinch it in a little bit. Didn't do such a great job. But her hair, I think her hair's been cut. Because she's got the shorter hair. And she, again, is a modern Barbie. So there she is. I've got her. She needs some shoes. I couldn't find any shoes for her. <laughs> and then I have this Barbie. I think she's a B, the BMR Barbie. But she could just be a fast. She's probably just a fashionista. And she's a fa Yeah, now that I look at her face, she's a fashionista. I need to do her hair, brush it, wash it. But here's her little outfit. And she has her little necklace. Now this is interesting. She doesn't have, I don't think she's a Mattel Barbie. I think she's what they call a clone. But I am going to put her in there due to, if you look at her compared to like this Barbie, there's not a big difference in their, in them. And she's got a pretty mold, base mold. She just doesn't say Mattel on, on her body anywhere that I could see. So, or any other labels that I could see. So she's, so here we have this little lady and she's in this dress here. Again, no shoes yet. <laughs> I 
And then this lady, I need to clean up her face a little bit. And I'm not sure she... If you know what Barbie line she came from, I am not. Different. Look at these eyes. She's, I want to say maybe she's like one of the um, Halloween Barbies. Because she's got kind of that witchy looking eye there. I need to see if I can clean this up today. Or, you know, between now and Friday. And then she's in the hairdresser outfit. And she'll have her, she'll have her blow dryer and her brush to go with her. And I have her in little cowboy boots. So I got these ones basically dressed. <laughs> They're basically dressed. Then I went to one of my favorite, favorite drifts. And I got a really nice Barbie haul here for you all. And uh, I was talking to the lady and she said she's going to have a huge... She has a warehouse that I've never been to. And she opened up her where, she's opening up her warehouse next week, weekend. I've never been to her warehouse. And she says this is full of toys barbie so i got this bag of three for five dollars um one looks like she's a rapunzel so i don't think i'm going to use her because i'm doing it's just like this is barbies that i'm doing so that's something i might run out to the southern thrift store if they're open day that's the thing of memorial day weekend they may be closed so let me get her out I got this one. Now, they're not dressed. And again, she's she's a modern Barbie. She needs cleaning up. Her body is stamped 2009. But she definitely, she's got, because, here I'll show you. The Rapunzel Barbie. Oh, her hair is gorgeous. She's, look how long her pony is. I may stick her in. If I can get this off, um, then I'll stick her in. I'm not sure. But here's the Rapunzel. Her face is great. But because of this inking on here, She's rubbed off because she was in the bag. And who knows how long she's been in there. She rubbed off on this Barbie. I have to go get some Oxy. The sun's been out, so maybe if I get some Oxy, it'll clear that up. She definitely needs a hair wash. Her hair is, is um sticky. So these Barbies are going to get cleaned up and washed. And then I have... And again, she's got that... No, her eyes are more... And this, I think, is a made-to, this is a made-to-move body Barbie. And her date says 2013. So we got a made-to-move Barbie. Love her little pony. Love her ponytail. <laughs> Such a pretty ponytail. That's the one thing about Barbie. I love, my favorite thing on dolls is hair play. Is being able to do their hair. And I'm really getting back into my Barbies. I feel bad because my AG dolls have been kind of neglected, but... And I'm re-looking at some some things. But here is Barbie, this Barbie here. She's so sweet. And um, like I said, she is made to move. She has her arms. She's made to move, every, you know, her knees, her ankles. So I got those three. But I got this bag. First, we'll start because it's on top. Got a Monster High cup. These I think you could get at when they were sold at the time. They're those they're those party cups, and I think you could get them at, at Walmart, Party City. That's a little cup. So this will go with I I don't know yet. I kind of like this. <laughs> it may go in the bag. We'll just have to see how things go. Um, so see, so you just don't know what could be in that bag. But I found um, I think this is for the pup. Like so you can carry the puppy. I found this Barbie little purse. So it may go in the bag. And then you can put like the little pet. The puppy in there. I got some puppies. So that may end up in there. This is a Monster High dress. I think it's Caddy Noir's dress. Yeah. It's Caddy's dress. I'm pretty sure it's Caddy's dress. I think, yeah. It's got the spider webs and. I've got some things going on. Okay, so that's how it goes. So this is Caddy's dress. It's got the big train in the back. It really needs to be fluffed out because it's been sitting. Who knows how long it's been sitting in that that bag of, that they have. Um, Yeah, see? Once you fluff it all out. <laughs> there we go. So i got a Caddy dress. And then... 
And this one here, it says Barbie Top. Now, see, in her clothes range, it was weirdest prices. Because, like, this little top was $2. And then she was having a 20% off sale of everything. So, I was like, okay. Um, but this was, like, $2. And I don't know why. It's just a little top with Velcro. I don't even know if it's got a Mattel. Yeah, see, there's no tag in it. But, okay. Um, I needed to get some clothes. So, I got this little top. Over there. And then, okay, these are Monster High clothes. And I'm pretty sure, and I could be wrong. But yeah, I think it's a Laguna dress. I'm not sure which dress. I gotta go through, like, all my Monster High. I've got body parts that I've gotten from her and other stuff. And see what I have, because I don't know this yet. Um, I think this is, okay, this looks like Spectra's shirt her little tank that looks like spectra shirt it's this way there we go got that one and then this is another little i don't know if this is monster high or not could be barbie i think this is barb this could be barbie i'm not sure it's a little the two top tank top but this i know is laguna's i'm not sure which dress of laguna's and I seem to have more Lagunas than anything. I don't know how that happened. But the little strap here is broken. But, I mean, this, I think this whole, it was $1.50 for all three of these. So, I'm not going to complain. But there's Laguna's little dress. I, like I said, I need to do some research and figure out whose clothes go to who. And which doll and all that stuff. And then she has the Barbie pilot coat. Let's open this up. I like to reuse the bags if I can. I don't think it's going to happen. <laughs> Here's the Barbie little pilot coat. And as you can hear Sabrina's cough. She's got that cough still. It's horrible. It says Barbie here. Cute. And this was another Monster High. At least I thought it was. That's why I grabbed it. In the Monster High stuff. Um, we'll see. We'll see when it comes out. And if any Monster High people on here, let me know <laughs> if it's Monster High. Now see this little, it's a little skirt. I don't, I don't, that's a little skirt. I don't know who that would go to. It's a little gold skirt. And then this shirt, it doesn't say Barbie or Monster High. It's just like a little vest. So I don't, not sure. If anyone knows, let me know. Oh, this little vest. Poor little thing. She's got to take her cough medicine. She does not like her cough medicine. Oh, and then I've got a pair of shoes. Which will go on one of these ladies. <laughs> And then this is Monster High. At least I know that the bathing suit is Ghoulia's bathing suit. That's why I got this bag. But I'm not sure about the other ones. Because, I mean, it's so little. I mean, I don't know what doll these would fit. If you guys know, I mean, these are teeny tiny. If you know who that fits, I don't have no idea. But it's got... Like a moon, moons on there. It looks like oh, something for Halloween, but yeah. She had all this little clothes like this. I don't know whose clothes those are. This to me looks like it might be, um, it's teeny. Maybe it's a Torali skirt. Not definite. There's a website you can go to, and I need to go to it and see so I can figure out what stuff. But this I know is Gulia's bathing suit. And again, the straps are broken. But again, it was $1.50 for the whole bag. So I'm not going to complain about that. And then she had this little donut shirt for like 50 cents. So I got that one. That's 
some tights. Some little tights. I don't know if they're Barbie or not, but we'll find out. And then this is another, I think this is Cleo's, one of Cleo's dresses. Oh. Pretty sure this is a Cleo dress. And, this, and then I got this, this fireman coat, Barbie fireman coat. Nothing fancy. Just a little, just to wear just as a regular coat. They said fireman coat, but it could be a regular just little coat. And then I got this little dress. I gotta wash all this stuff. It's a, just a little Barbie. Now this I'm going to say is from the, maybe from the 90s, little ballerina type dress, and I used to say how she would have played with with her Barbies. I grabbed this, it says this is a doll outfit, and I grabbed this for doll, for just regular for my dolls, I thought it was cute. So some of my bigger dolls. Another little skirt. And this little, now this is Barbie. It says Barbie. I'm going to say it's vintage 2000s. I think it is so adorable. It's like a little romper. Get a little closer so you guys can see. And this is definitely, I think, going on one of the, one of the dolls. And then I have this little... Got sailboats all over it. I this is a Ken shirt with the sailboats. And then I get all the loose things. And then there was just this little little shirt, kind of like a skater shirt. It looks like it'd be more for a guy doll than a Barbie Barbie. You know, a female Barbie. Like, more for a Ken. And if I'm showing anything that should not be Barbie and should be Ken, let me know. There's this little... This little skirt. Cute little skirt. Kind of like a paper feeling. And then there's this little dress. I feel like this is handmade, but it's not. The Barbies, I guess I don't pay too much attention to the clothes. Do they even, I don't even think they have the Mattel Barbie taking them anymore, do they? I don't think so. There's this little shirt. And this, this is totally... 90s, 2000s, look at that. <laughs> I like seeing this fashion. It's a cute little dress, little shirt. But I might keep it from Monster High. I kind of like it. I have a Spectra with some yellow on her. So I think that would be cute. She's the sport Spectra. I don't have her outfit. And then I got some more purses that look like they will go in the bag. We'll go in with the mystery stuff. So more purses to go with the, with the dolls. Things like, there we go, like this. Like there's no, no writing. Like this one here. Ooh. Get in, Lila. Come on. Let's see. It's like this little purple bag, this little pink bag. Might go with her. I don't know yet. I am really... I said I gotta work on the bags today. Let's put that on her arm there. That's a big bag. And then I got like this beach bag. And I got the blue beach bag. But here we go. Pink. That falls off. There. There's the little. Not working. Three times a charm. We'll see. If we can get our arm up. There we go. There. <laughs> like a little beach, like little 
geek fig there. Okay. I need my shoes. I hear footsteps walking around. Well, this... I don't know what's going on with this. It's, um... And it's a little shirt. Let me know which guys... I grabbed it, but I'm not sure. I don't know. There's no Velcro or anything. Let me look over her head. So I'm not definite. I didn't have a lot of times. So I like I ran over and her stores only open certain at certain times. Because normally she's at that warehouse, I guess. And um if she does it for cancer, her proceeds go to camp. But, oh, her stores are jam-packed with stuff. And then I found this little dress. It was a cute little, little dress, little pink sparkles. I don't know, I always associate pink with Barbie. Does anyone else do that? I don't know why. And then this little jacket is just adorable. It's a, you can't see, it's like a, a fluorescent kind of pink. And it is that pleather, but it's, um... It is in perfect condition. There's nothing wrong with it. Oh, it does have a Barbie tag on it. Okay. So it's definitely Barbie. You know that. Yay. <laughs> and I know this dress. This was my Cassie's. So this was from the 90s. It's from the Easter Barbie. See the bunnies on there? So that's from one of the springtime Barbies. Almost done, guys. Another little skirt. And this one has a snap on the back, so when you got a snap on the back, definitely don't think it's uh, 2000s. Definitely think it's a later outfit. And then, oh, I got this for my Malibu Barbie. I feel like this would have gone with Malibu Barbie. It's just the, remember the little terry cloth little towels they would get? Where is my Malibu Barbie? Where is she? I'm sorry, guys. I'm, oh, she's over there. I'm looking in the Barbie house. I'm going to do a tour of my Barbie house when it's all said and done. This is just a, it says doll skirt. So hopefully it'll fit the American Girl dolls. Let me see. Has it got any name on it? What a doll. So we'll see. I also have a couple of dolls coming. Like a Chrissy doll that I got for my birthday. And a Mia doll I got for my birthday that, um, are naked so this might fit them too but I'm not sure because they're not they're skinnier so they may not and it'd be too big so over here then I got another little Barbie skirt it's a little blue long blue skirt okay the elastic still good this little long blue silky skirt that one and then I think oh okay oh these I thought were so cute it's a little like trucker hat it's probably um Brad's a Brad's boy he needs them because now I'm looking at it that is way too big for Barbie's head I bet you it's Brad's let's see is there a tag no tag Let's see, let's see, see. Yeah, see, it fits my. Mm. And I don't really collect brats. If I find him in the wild, I found him in the wild. He had a mustache drawn on him. I need to clean up. So I found this trucker hat. I thought it was adorable. But yeah, I have a feeling it fits brats. It's got some Japanese writing on there. It just seems like the boy band brat doll would wear this. <laughs> so. Oh, and I got these jeans on whatnot. I got a whole, um, brats. She said they were guys' jeans, boy jeans, lot. So, let's do that. Let me put him back in the hidle here. He's by the... Oh, just the FYI, guys. I got this Barbie, too. She's, again, she doesn't have a label on her. 
but um, I'm keeping her for myself. But look, I put her in that red, white, and blue outfit that I hauled. Is that not cute? And she's got little purple shoes on. Is that not cute? Uh, I think it's adorable. I thought she would, that was a cute little outfit. Mm -mm -mm. Anyone go see the mermaid movie yet? Of course, we haven't. The Little Mermaid. Um, okay, and then I have this, which um, looks like it's a Frankenstein dress. And that's why I picked it up. Oh, yeah. So this is your a Frankie. I'm pretty sure it's a Frankie dress. If you look at the detailing on the skirt there, it's got like lightning bolt type things. And then this I knew was a Claudine dress. I don't remember which Claudine it goes to, but God, look how little they are <laughs> compared to Barbie. I mean, when you look at the Barbie dresses, like, so that's a Monster High dress. Let's do this. And then here's your Barbie dress. <laughs> so silly. So that's that. And then this was another bag that I grabbed that I felt was Monster High. I, but again, I could be wrong. She told me to come on by next weekend to her, like I said, her warehouse. She's got tons of Barbies. There's probably more Monster High stuff in there, and I'm kind of extra excited about that. So this in here, okay, yeah, this is somebody's wrap, probably for Goon Beach. And then I have a feeling, is that Halloween sock? One of Halloween socks. I just feel like it. This probably goes to that dress. I don't know. I mean, feel. I feel like that would be one of um, Claudine's socks. And then a little. Now these are little. Sh are they shorts or is it a? Okay. Oh, I wonder if these are Halloween's shorts. Anybody know? Be handmade. They're teeny. They are tiny. If anyone knows if those are Halloween shorts, let me know. And then there was this, um, I don't know what this is. It looks like a piece of this. This is a handmade something. I don't know. It is a piece of material, basically. And then I have another little, like, leg warmer. So, guys, that is my whatnot. Not my what. Well, it is my whatnot Goodwill haul. <laughs> not Goodwill haul. Thrift store haul. I didn't, this was not Goodwill. Thrift store haul. I hope you can join us on Friday at 7.30 for the Barbie mystery um, ladies. And on that note, guys, have a great Memorial Day. And we will see you on the flip side. Bye, everybody.